the forefront of healthcare change to turn innovative science into value for patients. This is a vision to which Astras aspires. We have been discussing what kind of pharmaceutical company we need to become to realize our vision. There are various types of companies in the global pharmaceutical industry, including mega pharma companies that handle a broad portfolio of diversified products in multiple markets. Specialist companies that handle products and solutions for specific diseases and therapeutic areas, and companies that manufacture and sell generic drugs. At the end, we decided that Astra should become a pharmaceutical company classified as a so-called breakthrough science developer. A breakthrough science developer is a company that creates new value for patients by exploring promising cutting-edge technologies and platforms and applying them to various diseases and therapeutic areas. On the other hand, until the mid-2010s, Astras was working to develop the concept of the global category leader, aiming to establish a competitive edge by delivering innovative drugs for diseases and therapeutic areas, including urology, oncology, and immunosuppressant, which prevent organ rejection after transplantation. In order to change direction and become a breakthrough science developer, Astras shifted from the previous way of creating drugs focused on a target disease to the new way where we narrow down the target through a multifaceted approach. This is our focus area approach. First, we choose biology that has a robust scientific footing to ensure that the drug effectively works on the target. Based on this biology, we then choose an optimal modality breaking free of the framework of existing modalities with small molecules and antibodies. Next, we select our target diseases attempting to fulfill unmet medical needs while keeping in mind development feasibility. The relationship between these three areas of biology, modality, and disease is shown in this triangle. By combining those three components, Astras identifies areas to intensively allocate management resources. The most important feature of this focus area approach is that projects created through the triangle do not just end there and that once the triangle are formed as platforms, potentially new drugs could be developed one after another, like a chain reaction. When multiple new drug candidates are identified and the lead compound has progressed to the clinical stage in the triangle, we designate it as primary focus. It is an area where we prioritize the allocation of management resources. As of 2018, our focus area approach was in the exploratory stage. Since then, we have designated five areas as primary focuses, and one out of the five has since then progressed to the clinical stage in multiple programs and completed drug discovery research. We are currently working on the other four primary focuses, and each of them has shown promising performance. Astras has built a foundation for developing innovative drugs with a focus area approach based on its corporate strategic plan 2018. Physical year 2020 marked the final year of the Corporate Strategic Plan 2018. We expect that the pharmaceutical products 
generated from this model will continue to strengthen the company foundation from the mid-2020s.